hello friends welcome to my channel today we'll be talking of how to send how to log in our app let users log in to firebase using phone number so as you can see i have login i have logged in to firebase using phone number i'm going to show us how, how we can do this in sketchway so when we send code when we send it will receive to so receive a pin then we verify it so we'll do this in sketchway first of all we have to in my previous video i'll drop the link i've shown us how to connect our app to firebase so after connecting our app to firebase we are going to head over we're going to head over to firebase so before going to firebase after we have connected our app before going to firebase i will drop the link of this app in the description we have to copy our shawan key which we will submit to our firebase console so google can know the app that wants to register the user so we're going to register our app for firebase login So, I have viewed my app and I've named my app OTP. OTP. So, when we connect our app to Firebase, we need to build it before so that we can generate our Shawan key. OTP. OTP with my package name. Which I've registered. I've added my app to Firebase, so I'm going to add this to Firebase. I'm going to add it to Firebase. So to add it to Firebase, I will go to my console account. From our console account, we come here. My app has been added. The previous video I've shown how to add app, so I'm going to add Shawan key. Which we copied from the app we just left. We're going to add the key. Then click save. We're going to click save after copying the key. So in case in case you don't know, when you want to copy it, you need to remove the extra text on the on the pin. So we need to remove this shower. So if you, if you encounter this, all you need to do is clear this, then you click save. So we go to our phone, phone authentication. So we enable phone odds, we enable phone odds, we enable phone odds. In our signing method, in our signing method, we enable it so you can see I have signed in to phone or so this is one of the method. So then we head over to Sketchway, which we will do the coding part. I've enabled my Firebase, so I created an edit text. To receive the user number phone number then i added input type phone this is our id text so our id text with our material button you can use normal button depending on your needs then our edit text to get the code when the code is sent so when we click this button when we click this button it will send if the, if the users provide the number if it doesn't if the user doesn't provide the number it will show an error so they provide the number we will send verification code using the phone number gotten so this is where the action is taking place so whatever you click on that button the actions will be executed here 
so how it works is when we click send verification it gets the phone number of the user and we send it we send it to firebase using this interface so when the code has been sent that is when firebase have sent us a message i created a string variable verification id so this will get the verification id when firebase sent us a message so when they send us it will be equal to the message they sent my string will be equal to the string that is the code i will get from firebase so when they have finished verifying so before verification will be complete completed sorry before verification will be completed we have this code in our second button click verify code so when we click verify code it will verify the code so the in case the user sends an old code we have to re-verify re -ver -re it sorry the user have to re-verify it so when the verification is success with no issues we check if the code is not equals to null if it's not equals to null then we set the text based on the code so after the verification we will sign into firebase using the credentials from firebase we we'll sign in and this is the code to back up the signing so we sign into firebase with the credentials so if if it's success user is successfully signed in we will show successfully signed in a user isn't signed in we will toast the message got in for firebase so let's build our app to see at the end of the day how we drop the source code so let's build our app i'll drop the project for usage so everyone values everyone values their privacy so before collecting user phone number you need to let them know they are collecting their number because google will store their phone number in firebase you need to let them know with our app successfully built i will sign in always start with your country code So the code has come. Verification code has come. And we are going to verify. Yeah. Now we are signing. So now we are signing just the way on sources, on sources listing on sources listing our phone authentic of Google Google login email signing. So it's the same thing with. On so say on complete listing now because normally in schedule we use on complete gmail signing so this is equals to on complete this is equals to it so this means the user have signing so if you want to send any message to firebase to store the user login info in your database after asking the consent of the user you can do it here so if there's error it will toast the error if main activity is not your activity then change it to your activity name change it to your activity name so normally when we use email signing there are some blocks we automatically use so in this case we can use get email this will get a, a null null value because the user didn't use email to log in but you can get the user's uid and check if the user is actually logged in so that is all also sign out the user thank you for watching this video to the project will be dropped in our telegram channel you can head over and download it